You know, you you put up a tweet. You said, I'd rather take my chances at killing an intruder in my house than calling mm -hmm. the cops. Mm -hmm. I'll call them afterwards and let them clean up the mess because I don't yeah, like I don't to touch, touch dead bodies. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. It's a, I seriously, I don't like touching dead animals either. That's one of the reasons why I think I stopped or don't hunt. I don't like to hunt. Um, and I don't eat meat, so, but I don't like touching dead bodies. It's something, it's, I don't know, weird about it to me. But I'd rather take my chances doing that because have you seen these videos of the cops coming in and shooting the, 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 the homeowner or the homeowner's friend? And they're lighting these people up, 30 rounds, yeah, or the guy with yeah. an acorn. Yep. I'm scared to call Hold the cops. Hold on, you saw that acorn video? Yeah, I'm Yo. scared to call the cops to have an acorn fall and I get lit up. No. Did, did you see him drop and rolling? Twice. He, <laughs> dropped, he rolled twice. That's a lot of momentum. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much. That was a uh, no. And then, you know what's the craziest part? He shot his own car up. Yeah. With somebody I, in with it. With somebody in it. The, the, it was only the grace of God that Thank that you. dude who was sitting in the car unarmed and handcuffed yeah. did not get lit up. I wonder if he's going to sue. I would. Of course. It, it, yeah. You know good and well. I hope so. Yeah, I, I hope would. so too. Yeah. I mean, My I, life's not the same. I got PTSD, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but I would definitely, yeah. I won well, the lottery. I, I think I think that officer has since um, left the force. Yeah, you know, yeah. as he should. Uh -huh, Whether uh -huh. it was in uh, by his own doing or or they kind of politely yeah. escorted him out the door. It's like my brother. Like, ain't no. Uh, it's it's a liability. Uh, it's a lot. I'm like I get. There's a reason why you should call the cops, but nighttime rookie cop. All he knows is home intruder, home invasion, and he sees my shadow, you know, running butt naked around the house. <laughs> He's gonna probably light me up. I was like, no, that's just sleep naked. You know, I'm not the bad guy. I'd rather take care of it myself. Yo, you you want to know something? I'm speaking to you, and I was doing research because I just wanted to know, and I and I actually found out that there there are. I was looking at the, the the ten deadliest snipers of all time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, these guys have hundreds of kills. Oh yeah. I didn't realize they were female snipers. Yeah. Um. Oh, what's her name? Oh, how did I forget that? Not Simo Simo Haya. No, no, no. Okay, I'm looking at a woman. Tell me if you know her name. Her, her name L L Lynn Mila Pavlichenko. Pavlichenko. Oh, okay. you know her? Yeah, yeah. I've done. I don't know her, obviously. But, but yeah. you know of her? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. We learn about, like, um, all this in, in sniper school. It's I forget what week it is, but you would do a history of some of the greatest snipers from, you know, even Carlos Hathcock, Simo Haya, um, Vasily, Vasily Zaitsev. I can't pronounce his last name. It's, it's Zaitsev. Zaitsev, yep. yep. We 225 about, kills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, do, you, do you, like... Even this woman, and I bring her mm -hmm, up mm -hmm. because number one, she's a woman, mm -hmm. but the woman got three. How, how many confirmed kills you got? 33? 33 with a sniper rifle, yeah. Okay, with a sniper rifle. We don't know how many when you were machine gunners. This woman has 309 confirmed kills. That's insane. I like, like, understand, yeah. she 10X'd you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ain't nothing much to say about it. I don't know. That's, Props to her. Pro Props to, but I'll tell you what, snipers, from my opinion, I think females make some of the best ones. Why? The way they think. They're more, um, I noticed it in like my wife. They're more particular about things, observant about certain things that we as men may not be observant to. Um, they're more, I'm, I'm more prone to act on I don't know, uh, aggression or act on, on something that a woman, uh, a female would na may not, you know, uh, react towards. They think differently, just genetically, scientifically, whatever you want to call it. They just are wired differently. That makes them calmer in certain situations, more relaxed. Their thought process is different. This overall, I, I think a calmer sniper would be a female. 